today I'm going to be making a welcome to our wedding board. These can be quite expensive so I thought a handmade crafted one will save you a bit of money. So all you'll need for this is a mount board or a foam board. I think I got a, a pack of a few of them for less than £10. Some white acrylic, a paintbrush, a piece of chalk and some hessian if you have some lying around. So first of all if you get your mount board or your foam board and then pop on some hessian over the top of it. So with my one I had some spare fabric lying about at my mum's place so I just got some of that, folded it over the board and just taped it along the back here so we've got quite a nice, nice rustic look to it. After you tape down your hessian then flip it back over to the other side and then you've got your board there which you can draw on so for my one I used a little bit of chalk just to outline the lettering to make sure that everything is how I want it to look and it's in the right place. And with chalk it's quite easy to rub out if you're making any mistakes on it rather than if you're doing it by pen. So I just did a simple welcome to our wedding and then our names at the bottom. So very easy to do. So literally whatever design you want you can just draw out the outline here. I just followed some images that I saw online and just go over and make it clear so when you paint it you can see exactly where you need to go. Sort of any mistakes you make you can literally just rub it out with your finger so it's nice and clean So then get some of your white acrylic or whatever colour you're using and just go over the lines that you've made. Now these are really nice to do if you've got a rustic wedding sort of set at a barn and just want something a little bit more rough and ready. with our stylist these were quite expensive to hire out or even to buy to get more personalized for yourself so it's quite nice to make something by hand and it's definitely a lot cheaper you can literally 
get the fabric, get the board and the paints from your local craft shop. It's going to cost a lot less than it would if you were going to hire it out or buy a personalised one. some of the fibres coming off of it sometimes so if you just dab them away with your paintbrush and then carry on. seating plan so that will be using the same sort of technique and style here with a rustic hessian background and white acrylic paint i'm hoping to make a nice sort of stag design on there because we're having a winter woodland wedding so we're going to have reindeers as one of the themes for the tables what your table plan was like, did you have a theme, what was the design, did you make it yourself or did you buy it? I'd like to know all the different themes that everyone's gone for, you've seen so many like superheroes or TV shows or holiday destinations, it's nice that everyone sort of can personalise it to themselves.
so we're going to be popping this sign just outside the entrance of our wedding so it will look nice as everyone's just entering. Let me also know in the comments if there's any other sort of arts and crafts that you'd like me to try or any wedding related crafts that you'd like. it's really simple to do just following the lines you made earlier with the chalk and going over it in some white acrylic paint. I think it's really simple and effective. Just as I'm coming to the end here, probably need to do a second coat because it goes into the actual fabric. So I will give that just another coat to go once over it again, just to make sure that the white's popping. And then I'm planning to finish it up with a nice ivy garland that I'll just drape around the outside and we're gonna have this propped up on an easel. So it'll be lovely just outside the front clear with the white writing and just a nice ivy garland around the edge and that th fits in with a nice woodland rustic theme but you can pick whatever you like you can add some more patterns and details around the edging if you want to or add different flowers depending on what season so if you've got a nice summer wedding making sure you've got corresponding summer flowers around the edge you can decorate it however you want 
but it's really simple to do nice and cheap and I think it's so nice just to be able to have something handmade by yourself at the entrance so people can appreciate what you've done so there we have it a welcome to our wedding sign made just of mount board some hessian and some acrylic paint it's nice and simple nice and cheap so hopefully you like that let me know down below in the comments and like and subscribe and i will see you in the next one Thank you.